Hey everyone, welcome back to the place we are testing every single glove that I can get my hands on. That joke just doesn't get old, does it? All right, uh, today we're looking at the Y Kang. Y Kang, probably because um, I'm guessing it's a Chinese brand and it's several random characters. That's not a joke, it's actually what they typically do. All right, let's look at Y Kang. Y Kang, latex free, powder free, disposable nitrile gloves, black. Let's see. Um, production date July 22. <laughs> it is suitable for daily hand production, such as home cleaning, chemical research, and farming. That is a motley crew of things to be doing. I'm going to do my own elongation test, if you know what I mean. I, I don't know what I mean. We call this the wince test. Oh, that's good. Wow. Whoa. That was like the best glove I've ever tested in my unofficial <laughs> test. Look at this. That's a strong glove right there. Holy cow. OK, Y Kang. I see you. Chinese made glove, a little bit old. You're going to find that the gloves on Amazon are going to be a little bit older. The thing about a glove is once you make it, starts curing and keeps curing. And so the older the glove, the harder it is, the basically the less that it will protect you. Um, so you, if you can, try to get those young gloves. How are we doing here? OK, so what are we doing here? We are doing an elongation and tensile strength test. What we're going to do is stretch this glove until it breaks. That's what this test is. You see these lines dropping right here? That's the glove breaking point. So what's the break point? Uh, it's how, how, many, how, how far we can stretch it. We want to see. Uh, with a normal glove, 500%. We've only seen one, two, three of those in our test lot so far. Um, this is an old glove. So we're going to give it the benefit of the doubt. It only needs to meet four to 500%, which you're going to see a lot more fall into that range. Here we go. Here the stretch is happening. And try to see where it is on this. Where is it? Do you see it? Right here. High? In the upper two, 25%. With a fairly steep arc. Is it 330? I don't see it at all. Oh, there it is. OK. Oh, it's slowing down. That's good. OK, it's met 400, so it's meeting that standard. It's still going. That was a strong ass glove, <laughs> which is a, a technical term, by the way. Strong ass. Um, OK, so it made it into the 500s. And we haven't, that's the fourth one that's made it into the 500s. So that's 508.48% elongation. Uh, again, you know, I just like saying elongation. So I'm going to say that as much as possible. Tensile strength of 46. Is that a record? That's no. Correct. No. Oh, thank you. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining. Y King, you make a good glove. Ah, tone down the gloss on the box a little bit, just a you know, personal preference. But would I use this glove? Yes, I would. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your time and attention. And I will, as usual, catch you on the next test.